Welcome guys, welcome to another video, welcome to Player Unknown's Battlegrounds. Well, well, hope everyone's alright. We're doing we are talking about reshade. What is reshade? Do you know what it is? Have you even seen it? Well if you haven't, you're just about to find out. Um that's something that's probably gonna blow your mind. Yes, it's reshade, and basically what it is is a more of a clarity, more sharper, more colourful um, content regarding player unknown, and you'll go, yeah, but they're very good at ha and they're very happy at banning people for little things. Yes, well, you won't get banned from this because it's been said that you're allowed it. Um, so yeah, you won't be banned from it. Player unknown himself said that you would be okay to use this because it's just basically a graphic appearance. So it's just meant to make it look better, prettier, if you like. So I will show you the tutorial now and I'll show you how what we gotta do um, and then I'll show you a bit of the play at the end and the difference. So basically you need to re you need to download it. So if you put in let's just give it that one. If you put in Google reshade.me that will bring this page up here. Um, this isn't just for play unknown battlegrounds. Reshade is a um, basically a graphical thing, um, and you can look at everything. Um, they do a lot of games and they improve a lot of games as well. Um, but obviously, we're going to do play unknown battlegrounds. So you download it. That takes you straight to the bottom. Um, push the green button on the download button. That will obviously bring it down there on the right side. Uh, let me just move this to my other screen quickly and then get rid of that and I'll bring that back. Actually what I'll do is I will change that over to there. There you go, make it a bit bigger so you can see it. Right. Um, so yeah, this will be on your worktop. Worktop? Even desktop. Worktop. I'm in the kitchen. Right, so you double click it. And then it come up with this here, say select game. So you click this, and this basically what you're doing is you're trying to find the path of where the main um, application for Player Unknown Battlegrounds is. So that's obviously Windows C drive. I've got mine on C. Some people might have it on a different drive. Program files x86 uh, down there to Steam, and then it's Steam apps for me, Common, and then Player Unknown's Battlegrounds. Then it's TSI game. Binaries, Win64, and that. Once you click that, you push open. Now it says select rendering. That's the option down below. It should always be on Direct 3D 10 Plus. So it's installing that. So wait for it to install. Yeah. Okay. okay do you want to? Yep. Yep. Well, it's just downloading. That's what I wanted. Right because I didn't push OK so you push OK on there and then it gives you all these options here now this is all the files that it can actually change the way the game or any game it's got in its content um, the way the appearance is we don't need all of them you, what you're doing there is just wasting an awful lot of time over um, stuff you don't really need all we need is clarity uh, clarity we need that one there we need colourfulness that is this one here uh, Luma Sharpen, uh, let's get, I hope I've got this right, Luma Sharpen and Vibrance, that's it, we only need the four, that's all we need, so we go OK, and that's it, installing to TSI Games Succeeded, that's it, don't need to do any more than that, what we what we actually need to do now oh, is actually up load the game, uploaded um, Plow and Owns Battlegrounds, Right, there it is, wondering when it's going to come up. So yeah, now you've unloaded this, the first thing you do before you start this program is that you need to go to the little cog and options. You need to set this to ultra, mine is already, so that's good. Um, ultra, and I've put my shadows and foliage down a little bit. I will leave that on high, I don't know too much how much it makes a difference to be honest. Um, I've tried them both on low and it seems to work a bit better when they're on low to be honest, but I've never tried them on high, I've normally put them on medium, normally I run everything on ultra. But because of this program it's better when they're a bit more or less. 
So yeah, as long as you've got that ultra there, that's the main thing, anti-aliasing. Apply that, and what you do, okay. So that's it, you're on the main screen. So what you need to do now is push Shift F2. This will bring this up here, and it says welcome, since this is your first time to start reshade, we'll go for a quick tutorial, we don't need that. Click continue, then you'll get to this section here. What you need to do here is click this add here, and then you're gonna save it. Uh, so you need to give it a name. So I'm going to save it, obviously, PUBG. I didn't push enter. PUBG. That's better. Right, and obviously now you'll see that we've got the same options as what we had previously when we chose it when we installed the program. So we we'll turn it on. You'll see as I do this, the background does actually change it makes it much more lighter, it's crispier. Here I'm just going to change this so I can turn it on and off when I like. I will show this in game, so Control F3, Control F3, and Control F3. And that's that. Continue, they're all on, including that one. Um, continue there. Here I'm not going to change anything, this is how I'm going to leave it. Um, there is loads of different stuff you can change, um, but I'm not actually going to, there, there isn't really anything, I mean you can do it individually, make stuff more lighter, more better and so on, but it's quite nice the way it is. So we just click finished, um, and then cross the tick at the bottom, uh, at the top sorry, to the right hand side, and that's it. And you, you can see, you can now from here, if I turn this off, you see the difference, as I'm turning that on and off. It's much more lighter, more crisp, more colourful, you know, there's more colourfulness in every bit of detail. Um, so what I do now is I'll skip over to the uh, a bit of the gameplay. Um, and then you can see the difference of um, different textures and different um, appearance. I'll be right back. Right, so we're in game now. And hopefully you'll notice the difference in colour. Um, not just colour, but more of sharpness. And you know that because if I stand here and I push Control F3, that's what it normally is. That's what you normally see in Player Unknown Battlegrounds. If I turn it back on, that's what you'll get. Look at the difference and the vibrant of the colours. It looks so much, so much, so much better. Control F3, normal. Turn it back on. Look at the colour in it. You don't. You, once you get this, you'll never actually go back to playing it how it normally is. Never. And then Control F3. That's what you normally get. That's with it on. Look at look at the difference that that is. It, incredible. Absolutely incredible. Um, what I'm going to do is we're going to land here quickly. I'm not going to play it, but obviously I want to land. So I want to land over there. Should I? Or, I mean, it's probably better in there. No, we'll land there. We'll come out and we'll land over there. We'll go into these these bits here. Um and then you'll see but but the, the colour is a, is so much sharper. It looks brighter, looks clearer, and obviously as you saw previously, you can have different ones. Um I've only gone for the main four ones, but you can have much more different ones than that. Um, and look, when I'm landing, you can see the colour, the colour of it, and the detail and the sharpness. It, it, it just looks and feels so much better. I mean, why this isn't not in game anyway, I have no idea. But it should be. There is no matter of word or lie about this. This game should be in it. So let me just land in this field quickly, so you can actually see a better understanding. So look, that's that's basically what I want you to see look at the brightness and just everything about it then now I turn it off that's what you normally see when you're in there and you think oh yeah it's not too bad not too bad at all then I turn it on look at the colour yeah it, it, it's it's so so sharp now much better I like it obviously everyone's got different opinions about it but it's it's like, let's just have a look at this bush, right? Got a nice little bush there, right? F, uh, control F3, I've set it up to turn it on and off. That's what it normally is. Now look at it. 
I mean, was we really playing like this? Oh, we must have been. Control F3 brings out the colour. Right, let me run up here because he's going to kill me. Where's he gone? He's over in that bungalow. Right, okay, that's alright. The great does a little sniper here. Uh, but yeah, yeah that doesn't really, I'm not going to play you, I'll just show you as an example. Um, but yeah, the, the difference um, of what it looks like, absolutely incredible. I'll just let him go and kill me. Cheers for the cheek, mate. Um, yeah, so that's... Um, Basically, that, that's basically it. But like the, the colour of it, as, as I'm driving this jeep along here now, um, and I'll, I'll just smash it over the over the hill here. You know, Control F3. That's what it normally is. That's what you're looking at normally. Now look at it. Look at the brightness. Just just look at the sky. You know, the, the sky is completely completely different. You know, look. There's that there. Standard straight away, and then turn it back on. Brightness. That's it. Well, I hope that helped you. Um, if you've got any issues with doing this uh, video, then please don't hesitate to leave a comment below. Um, but yeah, that is Player Unknown's Battleground. This is reshade.me. And just to clarify this again, um, you are allowed to play this in game. You don't get banned. It has been confirmed that we are allowed to use this on the game um, by the Player Unknown himself. Um, so yes, thanks for joining me. This has been another game. If you like the video, please leave a like. Please subscribe for much more content, um, new games, reviews and so on. Until next time guys, stay safe and look good. <laughs> <laughs>